Today we will be talking about bridges. Fun fact, this bridge, also known as the Brooklyn Bridge, was the first steel wire suspension bridge. Now let's get on to the fun stuff. There are eight basic core technologies, however bridges use structural technology. This is the technology of putting parts and materials together to create supports, containers, shelters, connectors, and functional shapes. There are many types of bridges, however there are four main types of bridges, arch, beam, suspension, and cantilever. An arch bridge is a bridge with abutments at each end shaped as a curved arch. They function because the weight of the bridge loads partially into a horizontal thrust that is restrained by the abutments on both sides. Beam bridges are supported by an abutment or pier at each end. This is known as the simply supported bridge due to such a basic layout. A suspension bridge is when the deck is hung below the suspension cables on vertical suspenders. And last, but certainly not least, the cantilever bridge, which is used building using cantilevers or structures that project horizontally into space supported only on one end. Now within these types of bridges, there are truss bridges, which are connected elements that form triangular units. There are three main truss bridges, Warren, Howe, and Pratt. Warren trusses use equilateral triangles to spread out the load of the bridges. Powell trusses have the diagonal slanting towards the outside, and Pratt trusses have the diagonal slanting towards the inside. Let's hit the road! There are three types of roadways, deck, pony, and through. A deck roadway has support, no support from the sides. It's a flat road. A pony roadway has support from the side. It's a deck roadway, but support's on the side. Then there's the through, which has support from the side and top of the bridge. Now let's talk about forces. There are four main forces that occur on a bridge. Tension, compression, shear, and torsion. Tension is a pulling force, compression is a pushing force, torsion is a twisting force, and shear is when two opposing forces act on the same point. Now this is all the basic info for bridges. Now, my bridge. First, I had to do re all the research I just explained to you. Then I made a design on Vectorworks, then I had to test it on West Point, and then I had to tweak my Vectorworks design due to weight issues. Then I started building with wood and glue. My bridge used more of the heavier slash middle pieces of the wood. My bridge was a Pratt and weighed 28.7 kilograms and had a load of 1,270.2, efficiency of 4,513.6. I could have had stronger joints and used a few more lighter pieces to make my bridge, but overall I was pretty successful. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is The Bridge Movie.